Welcome back to my channel Techno Trend Zone. Today, we're diving deep into some exciting news that's creating major buzz in the drone community. DJI, the global leader in drone technology, is once again making waves with the upcoming release of what appears to be the next generation in their ultralight drone lineup. The DJI Neo 2. This new model has recently passed FCC certification in the United States, which is a strong signal that its official launch is right around the corner. FCC approval is always one of the last steps before a consumer product hits the shelves, so this development confirms not only the existence of the DJI Neo 2, but also validates many of the leaks and insider rumors we've been hearing over the past several months. In this in depth breakdown, we'll cover everything we know so far about the DJI Neo 2 from design upgrades, safety improvements, and camera enhancements, all the way to extended flight times, transmission quality, and expected pricing. Whether you're a beginner drone pilot, a content creator, or a travel vlogger searching for the best lightweight drone for aerial photography, this guide will give you a detailed look at why the Neo 2 is already shaping up to be one of the most exciting drone releases of 2025 that the legacy of the DJI NEO series their original DJI NEO earned recognition for being one of the most compact, lightweight, and user-friendly drones available on the market. By staying under the critical 250G weight limit, DJI positioned the NEO as a drone that bypassed many aviation restrictions. This made it a perfect option for beginners, hobbyists, and travelers who didn't want the hassle of government registration requirements in many countries, the NEO 2 is expected to continue this tradition, retaining the sub 250G classification, which ensures it stays accessible and convenient for casual users while still being powerful enough for creators who want professional-looking results without investing in bulky, high-end drones like the DJI Mavic 3 Pro or Air 3. But DJI clearly isn't content with keeping things the same. With the Neo 2, they seem determined to raise the bar by introducing improvements in safety, imaging, and flight performance that weren't available in the original model, design upgrades and build quality one of the biggest rumored upgrades for. The DJI Neo 2 is the introduction of dual-layer propeller guards. While this might sound like a small change, it has huge implications for real-world use. Propeller guards add an extra layer of durability and protection, particularly for new pilots who are still getting used to flying. Minor crashes, bumps, Against walls, or accidental drops are far less damaging with these enhanced guards, making the drone more forgiving and reliable, this improvement could make the Neo 2 one of the safest beginner-friendly drones on the market, perfect for people who want peace of mind while learning. It also suggests that DJI is targeting not just enthusiasts, but also educators, families, and even kids who may use this as their first entry into drone flying camera enhancements, a major step forward perhaps the most exciting feature of. The DJI Neo 2 lies in its camera. The original Neo delivered decent image quality for its price and weight, but it wasn't particularly impressive compared to DJI's more premium drones. That's about to change, leaks suggest that the Neo 2 may come equipped with a 1-slash-1.3-inch CMOS sensor, a substantial jump from the original model's smaller sensor. While early speculation hinted at a full 1-inch sensor, most industry insiders now believe DJI has settled on the 1-slash-1.3-inch option. Even so, this is still a dramatic improvement. A larger sensor means better low light performance, allowing users to capture stunning shots during sunrise, sunset, or twilight, improved dynamic range. Meaning details in both bright skies and darker landscapes will be preserved more accurately, sharper photos and videos with richer colors and finer textures. When it comes to video recording, the DJI Neo 2 is expected to support 4K resolution at 60 frames per second. This is a game-changing feature for such a lightweight drone, as it allows creators to capture cinematic drone footage that looks smooth, professional, and ready for use in vlogs, travel films, or social media reels. Some reports also mention AI-powered image processing, which could automatically adjust settings like exposure, color balance, and sharpness to produce professional-looking results with minimal editing. This would be especially Helpful for beginners who may not have much experience with manual camera settings, improved flight time and battery capacity Another critical area where DJI seems to have made progress is in battery life. The Neo 2 is listed with a 1660 mAh battery at 7.16 volts, giving it a total capacity of 11.6 WH. That's about a 10.7% increase compared to the original Neo's battery, while DJI hasn't confirmed the official numbers, early reports suggest. The Neo 2 could achieve 20 to 25 minutes of flight time per charge. This is a solid improvement over the Neo's 18 minutes, and while it may not sound like much, those extra few minutes are incredibly valuable during real-world use. For creators, this means more opportunities to frame the perfect shot without 
Worrying about rushing back for a landing, smart flight features and safety DJI has long been known for its intelligent flight features, and the NEO 2 is expected to carry this legacy forward. Leaks suggest it could include automatic tracking, allowing the drone to follow subjects smoothly while keeping them in frame. Pre programmed cinematic flight paths, ideal for quick, professional looking shots. One touch camera moves. Making complex aerial maneuvers easy for beginners, safety also looks like it will be significantly upgraded. The NEO 2 is rumored to include an obstacle detection system with sensors in the front, rear, and bottom. This would allow the drone to detect and avoid obstacles automatically, reducing the risk of crashes. For entry level pilots, these features lower the learning curve dramatically, making flying less intimidating and far safer. Transmission system. And FPV experience one of the biggest criticisms of the original DJI NEO was its reliance on a basic Wi Fi transmission system, which limited range and sometimes caused signal drops. For the NEO 2, DJI may be stepping things up with a more advanced system, some rumors suggest a simplified version of DJI's 04 transmission protocol, while others believe it might still be based on an upgraded Wi-Fi system. Regardless, the general consensus is that we can expect stronger signal stability, lower latency, and a clearer video feed for first-person view flying, this improvement will be especially appreciated by vloggers and filmmakers who want to confidently Fly over longer distances or capture smooth, uninterrupted aerial footage in more challenging environments, pricing and market position When DJI launched the original NEO, it was priced at around $289 on platforms like Amazon. For the NEO 2, we can expect a slightly higher price tag to reflect the upgraded features. Most reports suggest a range between $299 and $349 which still positions it as an affordable, entry-level drone. At this price point, the DJI NEO 2 will compete directly with the Autel Nano, Hubsan drones, and Femi's budget models, but DJI's reputation for reliability and its polished ecosystem will likely give it the edge in this category, release date and final thoughts so when can we expect the DJI NEO 2 to officially launch? While DJI hasn't made any announcements, FCC certification strongly suggests the product is nearly finished and ready for release. Based on DJI's past patterns, we could see an official launch within the next few months, possibly timed for the fall season when DJI often unveils new products. Overall, the DJI NEO 2 looks like it will be a game-changing lightweight drone. By offering better imaging, longer flight time, enhanced safety, and smarter flight features while still staying under 250G, DJI seems to be delivering the perfect balance between portability and performance.